Hey there, this is Vanessa DeBerlay and welcome to my channel. Ah, I just had to come outside and film for the beginning of this. It's so beautiful out. We've had such a long winter. Anyway, today I want to show you how you can increase your views by using one of the tools that are available to you called the end screen. Now I know when I was new, some of you, if you've already done this, you probably need to just turn it off. But I remember when I was new, I absolutely was not sure what the end screen was or why I had to do it and how to do it. So I'm going to show that to you today. I'm going to go back in the house, get on my computer and show you where the end screen is, how it will help increase your views. It does work. And that's what we want, right? We want more views and we want people watching our videos and this will help accomplish that. So here we go. Let's go back in the house. The whole time I was just videoing that intro, the Winky was over here trying to get on my lap. Here she is. You've got to see her. She's beautiful. Anatola. And this is her little stash where she keeps her deer bones and different things. And she's like, okay, I have your attention. Now I'll leave you alone. And there she is. That's Winky. Off we go to the house. Okay, here we are inside the house and I'm at my computer. I'm going to show you exactly what an end screen is. And then once I show you what it is and how it can benefit you to grow your channel and increase your views, I, then I will show you where you can go to add it when you upload it and how you can go in and add it after it's uploaded. So I'll, I'll make it quick as possible. All right. So first of all, here's a picture of what an end screen looks like. It's the last 20 seconds of your video. And basically I have a little template that I made um, that says, thanks for watching. And then when I show you how to add it, it just adds to this page. Now, remember, um, there'll be a subscribe button and you can add up to three of these I always like to add a playlist but you could have somebody um You could add like the next video to your series, or you could say, hey, you might want to see what I did last week that goes with today, or you can put a playlist. I tend to do a playlist because the playlist, um, this one is about making money online with digital products, and I have a playlist about making money online. So my thinking is if somebody's here to find out about that and I offer them 20 more, 29 more videos, about that, then they might go ahead and click that and start watching it. Um, there is a way in your analytics to see which playlists are getting the most views. And this is one that I have that is getting views. So um, people are tending to click it. So this is what it looks like. You do not have to put a template in the back. You can just keep talking and the last 20 minutes of your video will just be um, where they'll add these end, end screens, okay? So you can do it either way. If you if you haven't done it before and you want to keep it simple, just add it. And then later you can start getting a little bit fancy. Some people like to keep playing their video and they'll downsize it and then have those end screens pop up. So let's find out how do we add it. Basically, this is an uploaded video and we're going to go through here. Now, when you get under video elements, you have the uh, choice to add subtitles and end screen and cards. Now, cards are different than end screens. Cards are videos that you place throughout the video. But today we're just going to talk about end screens and you can add them right here at while you're uploading your video. Now, this one, I probably put about 22 seconds, but you can see here. Um, the end of this video, I just had um, a car driving and you can add whatever you want. Um, like again, this is a video and a subscribe. You can import from a different video, a uh, playlist and a subscribe, which is basically what I always do. Cause like I said, I like to have that playlist there. And then I have my subscribe button. Now you can also add more videos, go up to here where it says element and I can say, okay, now I want to add another video and then what kind of video do you want you can do a, a, a recent upload now it's overlapping that's why it's giving me a i can put this down here i can put this up there 
um, add an element. We're going to do a video again. It'll let you know when you make a mistake. Okay, there's one called best for viewer and I can choose a specific video. So I can go in here and change that. You can only have three options. So you could have two videos in a playlist or three videos. It's up to you and play around with it and see what works for you. Um, now here's, I could put, um, here, I'll put one video that I chose and there you go. So I can put whatever I want. Now, what if you already have your video up? You've never done this before and you've got, you know, 20 or 30 videos and you want to add the end screens in now that you know how. Again, people will go to the end if they're really watching your video and they make it to the end, they're going to see that and you want it to be relevant. Um, you, you can even put the best for that viewer. I've done that before when I wasn't sure or when I didn't have a lot of videos. But now that I have playlists, I, I can kind of go into that. All right, so let's go to this next screen and I'm just going to edit a video that I have up. When you go into edit video, you want to scroll down and you can see right here where it says end screen and that's where you can edit it. And basically you get the same screen again. You get the same choices, same screen, and you can add your elements. And I've already got this up and I've got um, a playlist for this one. So that's how you do it. And it does help increase your views. This, like I said, people are watching your video, they get to the end and they choose more videos to watch and that's what you want. And that's how you get more subscribers and more loyal followers and the views. We, I think views are more important than subscribers, to be honest. If you have a thousand people, subscribers and they're all watching your videos, that's better than having 10,000 people who aren't watching them. So definitely work on getting views and increasing the quality of your video and making sure it's relevant to your audience. I hope this was helpful. Um, like I said, when I was new, I kept hearing about end screens and cards and, and I just wasn't sure what it was. So I thought I would do simplify it for you if you're new and hopefully you'll start using it. I hope you enjoyed watching it. Don't forget to give me a subscribe, give me a like if you liked it and definitely give me a comment below. Let me know what you think and you have a blessed day and I'll see you on the next video.